got this from the bakery yesterday on the way home. I'm gonna heat them up first. Scone actually is a roll. It's, like, <laughs> it's not bad. Let's try this. Very crumble muffin. It's very interesting how like the <laughs> name all these things different from how it looks. This is a scone, but it's obviously a roll. And this is a muffin, but it looks more like a crumble cake. Oh, but this one smells really good. feeling when you drink something warm and then that warm is like goes down everywhere to all your limbs stomach your color everything I'm gonna be making sandwiches for dinner my brother helps to buy the juice and cheese this is the chapasta I bought yesterday This up so that I can make a ham cheese sandwich. You are <gasps> oh, scary. <laughs> <laughs> I'm recording no? what I eat in the week. Oh, nice. Is it smelly? Do you need to wash it? There's a lot of like germs in the only. Okay, right. Like a six, like a six inch. Yeah, the subway size. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mm. Why is it like that? This up in the oven. I'm hoping that it will melt the cheese, but I think it's not hot enough with the bread. And then the ham, you know, for the ham, I found something quite funny. I was preparing the ham, and I realized that they kind of like heat a small one inside. sandwich, onion rings, and we've got a set of blueberries. So dry. Hot. 
Actually, I wasn't really hungry, but then you know sometimes there are days like this that I just like do my own stuff, and then I check my phone, and then I'm like, oh, it's almost four, you know, that feeling. I feel like I just get carried away, and time flies. I didn't plan this ahead. I think I'll just fry the egg instead. Okay. Fry the egg and while the water is boiling, I'm going to peel the orange. Cut the orange. I think I'll just peel it in the sink since it's just me. Unfortunately, I forgot to press record. It's okay, you saw the end product. Looks pretty good. In the past, when I used to make fried eggs, right, for some reason, my egg yolk would like lean to the side. So the whole egg would be like this white, right? And then the egg would be like at the edge. But I don't know, it seems to be getting better. I think baby milk and orange might be a good combination, but let's try. Nice. Even when I go to buffets or whatever, I am like to say okay with eating dessert and the mains at the same time. The fruits and the mains at the same time. Like, I'm not very particular about it. Oh, I just want the orange inside. It's a bit weird. But I think some people will be uncomfortable with it. Mm. Recipe needs bread flour. Must it be bread flour? Ganache. Normal battery. 
일단은 멘탈리는 일단 포기하고요. 다음에 시간이 더 열리겠습니다. character in the potatoes because of this and I bought this because when I saw it it gave me inspiration for what I could maybe eat for dinner tomorrow so yeah I was like squatting there and I thought about it for a long while whether I should still buy it when there's so many book on potatoes but I still got it so tomorrow I'm going to make macaroni soup and we have celery in the fridge so we can use that I bought um, spring onion and luncheon meat one of these days i want to try and make musubi so yeah so i bought luncheon meat and i bought peanut butter so i like creamy more than the nuts one and i bought a cucumber because why not have you guys tried um flat steamed baked bean buns before now the flat ones are actually very nice there's a particular brand that i was looking for called tasty bites and they don't carry it but probably is um, nice too so i bought it because i want to eat flat red bean buns apples um because we have ham at home i can make um, apple ham sandwich and i bought bagels to eat with the peanut butter and the banana so yeah that's what i bought and that's it for today see you tomorrow <laughs> sweet toaster cakes which I've just toasted and I'm gonna put some blueberry jam best jam on top and then some real blueberries I can feel it in my bones I can feel it in my bones got me looking like a clown Tell me what was let us down Tell me I'll be what I eat Can I do that got my needs Who's it gonna kill the sound Tell me what was let us down I can tell you you're a dancer Hot cakes? I think it's the same kind of cake as like cake pops This is the worst <laughs> So for the sandwich, you will need a bagel. You can use any other bread. It's just that the only bread of now is bagel. And an apple, some cheese. The cheese actually is very important. You need some sort of like cheese sauce or a cheese base. It'd be quite weird if it's just apple and ham and bread. So it'd be good if you can make like a sauce 
or just use cheese. I feel like that's the easier way. So now I've got my toasted bagels and I forgot to mention just now that actually you need cream cheese so I use cream cheese um, for the base and like I think previously I showed this cream cheese before and with the caption I wrote a thumbs up because like back then I was very afraid to put my opinions out on the internet so um, yeah, what I was trying to say is I like this cream cheese brand better than like the typical one that I guess everyone else knows. Yeah, my family likes this cream cheese brand better. It tastes lighter and less of that dairy cheese taste. There's a nice cheese is that like smelly smell. So yeah, I'm going to put some cream cheese on the bagel. Like this with the cream cheese. And then now I'm gonna put ham. Oh wait, mm. not ham, not ham. I'm gonna put the cheese first. Wait, should I just put one or? Okay, I'm just gonna have one. If you love cheese, you can always put more. I just do this. Like this, like me. Maybe like, maybe one up, one down. <laughs> okay. Yum, this is gonna taste so good. Cream cheese, cream cheese, sliced cheese, ham and apple. It's really super nice. But at the same time, I don't think you have to get good ingredients for it to be nice. Like if your apple is not nice then it might not be nice or the sliced cheese is not nice then it might not be nice so i think the ingredients do matter but this combination is really nice we are back in a very familiar place and i'm going to be making musubi i just need to do one cup of sugar one cup of mirin and one cup of soy sauce but whoa one cup is too much for me maybe half cup Break this cheek off the Oh no, so big. Use this thin kanjang. Once you start using kanjang, I feel like you cannot go back, you know? It's a very flavorful soy sauce. Hm. Oh, it feels like a lot. It feels like a lot. You know, we got mirin. Okay, I feel like chicken water cup is still kind of a lot. <laughs> okay. I need to slice some luncheon meat and then I can put it into this sauce. But the only bad thing about like not buying spam is that I cannot use the can as a mode, which I see a lot of other people doing. I have so many pieces. I'm gonna be eating lots of lunch and meat today. I wanna make some for my dad because he actually really likes lunch and meat. So I want him to try this. I've never made musubi before, I've never even eaten musubi. But it's always the first time.
And the only thing about it being so brown is that I can't really tell whether it's cooked inside. Mm -hmm. Whoa, this one looks nice. Yeah. The CV is too big, I need to cut it thinner a bit so that it looks nicer. But let me just try. Mmm. I thought the luncheon meat would be sweeter. square versions because this rectangle one's very very hard to stay intact but yeah the verdict about the Mercedes is that it's actually a lot of work and if you want to make it get yourself better seaweed because I think this one is the kind that you just like eat with the rice you know so it's not very strong in holding the subi together eat one more of these eight ones and then maybe I'll leave some for my dad to try okay not maybe I'm like for sure I'm gonna leave some for my dad to try because I can't really eat this whole plate by myself You said it's the saving grace. Mm. 
marshmallow in the loop. Hmm. Like that. Mm -hmm. Nice. The chocolate nice. Eh? Mm. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> you wanna. Oh, it's all. You obviously know inside. Oh my god. Music and everything. Oh, you make YouTube videos? Hmm. Mm. I think that's all for the week. Thank you, Master.